Civil War buffs have a rare opportunity this month at the Mariners Museum in Newport News. They have a chance to see the turret from the USS Monitor, an estate never offered before. And if you happen to have an old radiator around the house, the museum may have use for it. 13 News reporter Velma Scaife explains. Normally, to see the gun turret from the USS Monitor at the Mariners Museum, visitors have to look at it through a chemical water solution. But this month, the tank is drained. Prime opportunity now for the next four weeks to come and see what's happening. Conservators are removing a lot of the hard sediment the turret gathered while on the ocean floor and collecting artifacts. It's not a job for the impatient. For four days, Tina Gutschall has been cleaning out a section that might contain five inches of rope. It's a part of the artifact, it's part of the story. Um, not very far from there is an eye bolt where the rope might have tied in. So, and it's right near the hatch. So visitors can better understand the steam technology that powered the ironclad ship. Various components are being remade. Cast iron from old radiators, sinks and tubs will be melted down and poured into molds. So we'll run it on either steam or compressed air and we'll actually use it to pump water and really teach people how the technology worked and why it was so important. It was important 140 years ago and its history important now. When this hatch closes at the end of August, it'll probably be another five years before visitors will be able to get this close to the gun turret. In Newport News, Velma Scaife, 13 News. Now, next month, a solution of pure water and other additives will be put in the tank for one last big push to remove any remaining sediment.